Why have I just found strawberry jam all over me? Great. Hi guys, I'm Jerusha and you're watching Jerusha to a TV. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. Say hi, I'm Matthew. Hi. 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 That's kind of his version of hi. Hi, I'm Matthew. Do you want to tell them we're vlogging today? Sorry, he's a boy. He doesn't stay still and has strawberry jam all over me. We are currently in a little bit of a shambles, aren't we, darling? I am just trading out my bag, aren't I, from my GST, which is beautiful. I've been carrying this for the last week, but it ended up with so much like miscellaneous stuff. Come here. So much miscellaneous stuff in it that I'm going to trade it out today to my Neverfull MM in Damier because it'll hold a lot more junk that you put in it. Come on. Let me just get this strawberry jam off. <laughs> That's so helpful. Can you come back here so you're in the picture so everyone can see you? You can show them, Bunny. Uh, so I'm just currently trading this out with him here because... Let's get him in the shop. Because we say hi guys, hi, hi guys, good waving. Because we are going together. Say, oh, ooh, mommy's poor, poor. Wait a minute. Massey and I are going together to a secret meetup <laughs> at Westfield Bonner Junction. We're going to be meeting Serena and Stella today. They haven't seen him since I think he was four, four or five months old. So I am just quickly going to trade out this stuff, but I'm not actually going to change anything in the way of SLGs. But that is the GST empty, so I'll just put that back up for storage. And in this Neverfull MM. I mean, I don't even have to worry. I know that everything and anything will go in this baby perfectly. So I don't, oh, do you want to hold them? Okay, so I'll put my keys. I'm using my card holder from Chanel um, for extra cards. That's working a treat. I've got a lot of coins in my round coin purse. Are you looking at my mirror? Are you looking at this? mommy has got a little mirror. Um, but over here, I'm going to just bring that as an extra makeup case. So that's my um, GM cosmetic case. Sorry, that's very matchy matchy. <laughs> um, this is my um, Chanel um, O small O case um, that I got from my subby Shanti. And I'm just using that as my kind of catch-all. Um, so we'll pop that in there. Sunnies, I'm still going to wear my sports girl. We'll put these, mirror, paw paw, my phone, spare cash, I need to pay someone. My wallet I'm using is my all around zip, uh, I think this is called the O coin purse as well from Chanel, so I'm using that as my wallet. So I will pop, pop that in there and of course my agenda, trusty agenda, um, some hand wipes which are now out but I'll get new ones, we'll put them in. And I don't need anything of Mussy's because I have his baby bag. Uh, but yeah, so that is packed up, kind of super heavy, but we'll take that today uh, instead of the GST. Okay, so we will see how this goes. I have to go upstairs and finish my coffee and get Mussy completely ready, heat up his bottle. I'm going to give him his bottle in the car 
and uh, we're going to head over there, see if he might have a little schnooze in the car on the way there. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, but yeah, come on. Don't you want to say bye? Bye, guys. Look, he's tired already. Come on. Anything you want to say? Anything you want to say? Do you have a cool outfit on? Let's do outfit of the day for you. Yeah. Oh, that's Mummy's handbag. This is a Spencer from, is it from Zara Kids, maybe? Or maybe it's from Target. Mum got it from him. And he has one shoe on and one shoe off. <laughs> and these cool jeans with braces are from Auntie Jen. <laughs> she sent them over for him. I did unbox those on a vlog. Oh, okay, bye. I did unbox those on a vlog, but they're so cute and they have the little braces. So that's his outfit. Uh, mine is just this nice cape, long jacket, and just a black tank and compression leggings, and that's it. Makeup is pretty, pretty simple. I just did my usual kind of look uh, with uh, Vixen lashes from Socialize. I'm actually really happy I've gone back to buying Socialize lashes uh, from Carissa Pukas. I will link them below. They're great lashes, really, really great. Uh, so yeah, let me go finish my coffee and then we'll head on the road. Uh, <laughs> excuse me! Excuse me! Are we vlogging today? Oh, he wants to show you how he can stand. Come on! He's such an undercover walker. Like, I think he walks on his own, but when he's by himself, he, like, walks. He walks in his cot and then when I look at him, he, like, sits down. Don't you? Don't you, friend? Don't you? You don't need that dummy. You're just being a baby. Look how long his hair's gotten. <laughs> Let's go. Massey is listening to his classical music on our ride to Bondi. <laughs> he loves his classical music. But. I am not going to be vlogging because I've got little marsupial in the car with me. So the camera is going to go off now. I did want to just show you though. did want to show you that I am wearing again my uh, 119 Rouge Coco Lip Gloss by Chanel. And I maybe want to look at some others when I'm in Bondi. Just, you know, so this is the one in the last uh, vlog that I did, Massey's birthday party, uh, where I quickly just said, I love it because it's like my lips but better. And I can just wear it. I don't wear any liner. When I usually do full like zhuzh lips, I'll do liner and everything. But I just love it. can't believe it. It's very pink. Very pink for me, but I do love it. So, let's see how his milk. He's looking a little sleepy. We're gonna go for a drive. He's got bunny. So I will see you over in Bondi. Are we going to go and see the girls with Mussy? I'm just so excited for them to see Mussy. That is mainly, I just get so happy to see people see his growth. Anyway, let's let's get over there. When I say someone fell asleep in the car, so we ended up continuing to drive and we've ended up in Coochie Beach. Did you try to wake up? We're in Coochie Beach. Yeah, just woke up. I'm gonna show you Coochie because it's stunning. Is it a bit windy? Is it a bit windy here in Coogee? A bit windy? 
There's lots of doggies. Doggies. Loves dogs. <laughs> okay. You're awake now. Let's greet Auntie Serena and Auntie Stella. Yes. Hi. Hi, guys. I'm awake. Hi. Okay. What are we doing, too? Okay. The ring. Okay. Okay, we're here. I'm just here. Is that okay? I just left it there. We are here, but it wouldn't be ballet unless I show you the cars that are out today. A, what is that? A Dodge? Oh my God, I don't know what that is. And a Ferrari. Do you like them, Mutti? Would you like one of those? Would you like one? Come on, let's go. Say we're going to go in and see. Say we're going to go in and see Serena and Stella now. Going to walk in. They're doing massive, massive renovations still to this place and it's even smaller. We're going to walk in. Come on. Walk in. Ready? Oh my gosh, look how cute this is. Oh wow, walking, walking. Hi guys, I just got into Baton and I just ran into one of my subbies, Katrina. Hello. I was walking Mussy in, because hey. I was walking him in and she was like, oh hi. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. It's lovely to finally meet you. Hey, Marcy. Hi. 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 Thank you for on the vlog. Oh, anytime. You're welcome. Let's go see Serena. He's adorable. He's adorable. Yeah, it's actually kind of like weird but nice Serena. to see him like growing up oh, really? and then you finally meet him. Like, oh, really? Yeah. That's so nice. Yeah. Thanks for watching. But we love seeing you because like you're an Australian like vlogging. Yes. So it's like real for us. Yes. So it's just nice. Love it. Yeah. Love it. I had to make a quick stop in the parents' room for some raspberries and orange juice. Juice. Someone was getting a little bit thirsty and Vuitton was just really full. They've just got that um, temporary store right now which is absolutely <laughs> tiny. The new store is going to be absolutely huge and beautiful, but my gosh, that one they're working with is so small. Anyway, oh, you want to get up? You want to... Okay, okay, come on, pull up like swimming. Yeah, good job. One at a time, one, one at a time, one at a time. Um, yeah, anyway, the new store is going to be amazing, but right now, thank you, right now, they're working with the tiniest little space the chewing choo 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 chew thank you oh my god this kid could eat this whole tub of raspberries one more one more <laughs> let me see you chewing oh drink your orange juice oh drink your juice stop oh <laughs> Looking in your eye, kiddo. Well, that girl just looks like my friend. Okay, mum life is really not going to plan. I haven't gone back to Vuitton. I had to actually go upstairs and feed Mussy. He was super hungry. And I've just come into Topshop because apparently they're closing down. I'm a bit gutted, I'm not gonna lie. But I wanna see what you guys think. Do we like this? What? Is that like a Beauty and the Beast sweater? I think so. I love when people look at me vlogging with a camera. This is full blown public vlogging. And I own it now. I'm proud. I'm proud. I saw Lydia vlogging on the side of the road the other day. And I was like, yes, girl. Vlogging in public is the juge. Every. YouTuber who vlogs should be able to vlog in public. Nicole Guerrero stuff. It's hardcore. I'm extremely embarrassed right now, but I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Not gonna lie, 
just stopped in. Mummy's looking at Gucci, Baba. What do you think, Masi? The velvet just came in. The black velvet. Here's the purple. Wow, it's really pretty. It's even prettier in person. So that's the mini, and that's a small. Yes. Yes. <gasps> oh my gosh. Some people really don't like what Gucci are doing, but I just think it's so fresh. So fresh. What do we think of these? I think Jen has these. Do you have these, Brie? They're so mange. I like them. Okay, just temporarily <laughs> while the essay is with Mussy. Oh, no, he's not. I'm just trying this on. What do we think? Very cute. So I'm really liking this. I originally looked at it online in the mini, but I'm going to show you the mini. Are you ready? This is the regular size that the SA Costa just showed me. Look at the mini next to it. Whoa! What do you think, Mussy? Wow! Are you being silly? So the mini is definitely mini. Like this is my hand. And that's the normal size of the like the little blogger bag, the Marmont blogger bag, which I really like. I've wanted the Soho Disco for so long, but this is the new version. Ish. And then it's got the G. I love that. That's mad. Yeah, that is so nice. That's sexy. Okay, Costa. Just yes. like I can't really I can't vlog your face, can I know? Um, I don't think so. I don't know. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, he just pulls out the mini mini. This is what he says. Oh, have you seen the, like, the nano? Look at this. Super the super mini. Oh my gosh, it's the size of like a mini pochette. That is so cute. And then look, and he said, and it's in the Dionysus as well. Stop. They're the size of like a wallet. Oh my gosh. If you had a little girl, that would be so cute. You're not a little girl. Oh my god, I just stopped in at Chanel to see Michael and they do have the mini trapezo that Jen has. Oh my gosh, I love it. That is so cute. Thanks. Oh my gosh, you guys, that is so darn cute. I don't know if this is the color Jen has, but this is the pink, like a pinky kind of color. Look at the new cocoa handle in the chevron. Never been done before. No, no, no. Oh really? And look, it's like in this vintage kind of pattern, distressed kind of, is that, would you say that's like antique? What does it say it is? Antique pattern or something? Oh, Chanel and their fabulous names. Black, well done. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful though. I'm loving the hardware. Masi, look! Hi! Do you love the girl? Do you love the girl? He's a natural. Okay. Is he just like beelined up the corridor for Manun? <laughs> Wait. So cute. How cute. So okay, cute. Serena's gonna show me some stuff that she put on hold for me. So I really wanna show you guys. Just wait, you ready? Are you ready? Wow. Oh. You, you can take him home if you like, Manon. Wow, guys. <gasps> this is kind of nostalgic, I'm not gonna lie. I owned, if you followed me for a while, you know I owned the Montserrat MM. And this is honestly pretty much comparable exactly to that size for sure. For sure. 
the GM is way bigger than this, but it it's given me it's given me old school monstery MM for sure. Wow, beautiful features, very beautiful features, very similar to um, Palm Springs. How pretty it's done, and it is really soft and beautiful, like Amanda said. Actually, it's really pretty. Oh my god, you guys, these are the new miniature charms. So that's the normal size charm. And look, this is the miniature charm. Oh my god, that's so cute. You see them next to each other. And then this is a regular size. Look how much bigger. Oh, they're so cute. The little miniature charms. Oh my god, that's so cute. I love that. So this is the new pouch that's come out. I had heard about it. Serena just showed me. Kind of reminds me of like a technology pouch, but apparently just on the hush hush it's going to replace the pochette accessories apparently which is very crazy um excuse me excuse me <laughs> she he won't leave serena's side what? we have officially finished <laughs> officially stuck the dummy oh i think serena's done is she Oh, I can't fit in there. Oh my gosh, I think she's done. Okay, she was just wrapping up some parcels that I might have gotten. Okay. Okay. We are here. Okay, hi guys. Uh, we have just got home. Um, that was such a good run and such a good, like, just get in there. And I, you know, the bag that I had um, um, ordered with Serena came in. Another couple of items came in, so I got to look at them. But Massey was so good. He lasted so well, but I tell you what, it, it, it it was full on. Firstly, the store is so much smaller because obviously it's the temporary store. They're still doing their remodel and expanding it. Uh, so, but it's going to be so beautiful when it finishes. It's going to be the same as the remodel and the fit out of the um, Pacific Fair in the Gold Coast. Thank God, because that is the most beautiful boutique. I have seen it is so gorgeous if you're up in the Gold Coast go check it out you probably already have but it's just so beautiful so apparently the Bondi uh, Junction boutique is gonna become like that so that's really good but right now that temporary that temporary juge is serious like it is so tiny in there but so I didn't really want Massey to stay in there like if he was uncomfortable so I was trying to walk around with the pram and then he was hungry and then I went back and I got my bag and I was looking and then I paid and then Serena wrapped him. So uh, here is the item, which I will do an unboxing video. Here are some other little items that I didn't want to go past. I'm going to quickly explain on this vlog what is happening i'm doing air quotes because there's a lot of speculation and everything there are some fantastic videos um in our community here on youtube done the purse forum has heaps of information on this heaps of information on the discontinuation of canvases canvas bags quote unquote um so now that you know we've seen that the Eva clutch has been discontinued. The pochette accessories is harder to get your hands on. 
and things of that nature. So it's just harder to get your hands on these items. They're trickling in really, really slowly. Uh, but however, I'm going to list a few of the really good videos below that I've watched and that are circulating. Foxy LV, hi love, she does the coolest video updating on sort of all the details of this. Uh, but there's many different sort of views on it. I still believe that your essay, wherever you are, can probably uh, request uh, request in bags and 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 bring bags in for you uh, still I still think that I don't think it's gotten to a point where they're like bags are just gone I don't think we'll ever get to that point hopefully I just think that they are pulling back on canvas bags and canvas SLGs and items and first-hand information from the girls is that yes like foxy lv's right <laughs> that um they want to go for you know a step up they want to go for the all leather bags they want to push the leather bags rather than being known as like the canvas travel company really and i can understand that they want to have like evolution they want to grow they want to change uh which is great I still feel really sad for people that want to get into Louis Vuitton and want starter pieces because full leather bags are not going to be starter pieces. But I do understand how they can't keep price increasing canvas bags. So, for example, you go in to get a Neverfull, a Neverfull, you're never going to walk in and a Neverfull be $4,000. $3,900 and that's where it would be going with price increases like the most ridiculous amount for canvas bags they just can't charge that kind of money but for leather bags they can charge that kind of money you know their cap you see in line it's all been doing quite well in the steamers and things like that um, so as you can see there's kind of less growth in canvas so and then yeah look I said to Serena, I can kind of understand. I also feel like general inflation in retail, so is just getting it too close. Even though luxury can be astronomical, astronomical, sorry, like Hermes and like Chanel's prices are just through the roof, and we all know that. But um, I f I do understand the categories. Are not as separated when there's inflation like everything is just inflated in life in general so you've got high street like your H&M's and your Zara's then you've got boutique so you've got like Michael Kors, Ted Baker, Kate Spade the gap between that and luxury do you see what I mean like if they stay in that realm of like the canvas bags you can pick up an SLG for $200, $200 you know what I mean and 200 and something called dollars like a clay is like it's too do you understand what i'm saying like it almost doesn't ballpark it to luxury enough that's the that's my opinion that's not information but i can see it like that they sort of want to make themselves you know put themselves up on a little bit more of uh, that sort of like that sort of like demand <laughs> supply and demand type level like Chanel and Hermes are you're gonna have a big pre-loved market now and that's really shitty because it's gonna inflate the pre-loved market crazy like you're gonna be paying through the nose for canvas pieces on pre-loved markets like it's just the way um, supply and demand so anyway um, that's the information I got I will say it was really hard for Serena to get her hands on this. It It's just kind of nuts out there. Supposedly, there's waiting lists for the craziest, craziest things like, you know, any Eva clutch they can get their hands on, Pochette Matisse still, massive, massive waiting lists. And I'm talking up to like 40, 50 people. Now, that is a lot of people. So, and that's in Australia. So, anyway... Uh, comment below if you've heard about it. I know it's circulating everywhere. The Purse Forum has heaps of information on it. And then always read the comments in all those other videos because there's a lot of people who comment what they know, which is really handy. 
Anyhow, I've got to go and take care of my son now. He's with my husband. But uh, yes, I hope you enjoyed that vlog. I will most obviously have an unboxing video to come, uh, which I'm really pumped to do because it will go hand in hand with what's in here to be with what's in here. Yay! That will be exciting. So that will, coming, that will be coming and I won't be leave you waiting too long. It will come this week. So I will leave you there. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this vlog, guys. If you enjoyed it, please give us a thumbs up. If you love seeing Mussy, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel already and you wish to do so, guys, that would be really cool. I will see you in my next video, which will most probably be an unboxing. Take care. Peace.